Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited this week to be sharing a brand new video featuring some of my all time most favorite workbench plans. Now trying to build projects without a workbench is like trying to cook without a kitchen. So if you have nothing, the one I recommend starting with is this simple workbench made out of two by fours. It's very sturdy and it's got a nice size top that you should be able to assemble most any project on. You can use two together and put a miter saw in the middle. You can put it on caster wheels. It's just a really versatile, easy to build plan. Okay, so if you have no space, this folding workbench that I built for my sister may be the ticket for you. Now this isn't a heavy duty workshop bench that you can be pounding nails on with a hammer. What it is is an assembly table that keeps all of your things nice and neat and stored and um, it just organizes everything and it rolls out of the way. So if you're limited on space, this might be the one for you. It's made out of one by twelves and then uh, we use some two by fours for some supports and then some three quarter inch plywood for the fold out leaf system. We put a drawer in it too because it's always nice to have a drawer that you can just pull out and you know keep your tape measure in it and it makes the space on top bigger because it kind of serves as you know a temporary workbench area and then it just folds out with the two by four legs and it was actually pretty sturdy she's still using it today um, a few years later all right so the ultimate roll away workbench is you know probably the most built workbench that i've ever done and what it is is a miter saw stand that features two rollout carts on the side um, and the carts can be customized to suit your needs. And then when it's put away, it looks all nice and neat and clean. There are so many different ways to customize this project. Okay, so number four, we have a pony wall workbench. So how this one's unique is we really wanted that built-in workbench style, but we want, didn't want to pay for individual cabinets. So we used two buys to frame out like a toe kick for the floor. And it's really cool because we actually did a 16 foot long workbench cabinet here and we built it all in one. So this was really fast. It was really easy to do. We were able to shim it up and get it perfectly level. And then from there, uh, we just built two, you know, quote unquote pony walls and set them on top. And this works as the front and the back of the workbench. This gives the framing for it. So from here, we can just add you know, inexpensive plywood, scraps, whatever, to cover up the bottom and the ends. And then we actually, um, we put three quarter inch plywood on the top to give it a nice work surface. And then we built drawers to fit in the upper portions. We're still using this workbench today. It worked out really well for us. Um, the drawers are very handy and it's very heavy duty. Um, we also cut out one of the bays and put in a miter saw station so it works as a cutting station too. So this was a heavy duty, inexpensive way of creating a very long workbench quickly and easily and it's definitely going to hold up to whatever you know you need it to do in the garage. Okay, so if you just need somewhere for your miter saw to go, um, we do have a miter saw cart plan that you can use and it's got fold up wings on it. Now, um, these the shelf brackets that we use, they're just for supporting your in feed and your out feed for cutting. If you want something heavier duty, you can do a modification with a wood board like many of our readers have done. And finally, we have our dream workshop. So this is a roll away workshop that covers an entire floor to ceiling wall. So there's storage on top and then the carts roll out to do um, all different sorts of things. So we have a miter saw cart that you can pull out and use. The other carts work as in feeds and out feeds for your miter saw. They also work as in feeds and out feeds for a table saw if you want to do a table saw cart. This is such a compact workshop that's easy to customize got all the storage on top. It's um, one of the most built projects on our website, so make sure you check it out. All of the workshops featured in this video have plans that are completely free. We've got a link in the description to all of those plans and to many more and many brag posts so you can see different variations of it. So please take a second to click on over and check it out. Thank you so much. We'll see you next week with a brand new video.